Hi, how are you doing? Every one of us got a mission in his life and it's so hard for us to believe and to understand the importance of our mission because that our self-esteem is so broken and and we find it hard to believe that who that we think that we are is who that really Hashem, the Creator, sent us to be. And the struggle and the fight and that war of ourselves against our sadnesses and our low self-esteem, that's the battle and the war against the evil inclination. That will be the, the battle that will bring the complete redemption to the world. Now, how are you going to know inside of yourself who is the real you and which of the voices are only voices of fears, of sadness and depression and anxieties and not really who that you are? It's written in the verse, Pikudei Hashem Yesharim Mesamche Lev, that when you serve the Creator in a straight way, in the right way, so it brings happiness to your heart. You need to count on your logic and to believe in your judgments and to listen to your senses and to be aware to your emotions and to follow all of the inner signs that are guiding you to safety, to confidence, to happiness, to satisfaction and to follow them. They will bring you to happiness they will bring you to happiness. And happiness is close to the Creator. Like the verse is saying, that's what we're blessing in the wedding of a new couple, that they, that they will remember that the happiness is coming from Him. When you're happy, really happy, it's because that you're close to the Creator. And when you're sad, it means that you've been drifted away to negative thoughts, to bad judgments, to the world of lie, under the power of imagination, instead of being one with the Creator that is all good. So even in the hard hours, we need to understand that there is a purpose to those hard hours. And even in the difficult times, we need to remind ourselves that there is a purpose for our challenges and our sorrow and it doesn't mean that we need to accept it. We can still fight and argue and pray and beg and, and do as much as we can to redeem ourselves and all of our beloved ones from every kind of pain and sorrow. But to understand that there is a purpose to what that we're going through and to understand that there is a guiding hand supervising Creator that is taking us in that path. This is a very precious piece of information that can bring a lot of happiness to our hearts. And then that happiness will bring us to completion. Even happiness that will not going to bring you in the beginning to dance in the streets and to clap your hands and, and to smile, huge smiles. Even simple understanding and completion Accepting yourself on being who that you are is real happiness and real closeness to the Creator. So to be close to Him and really to find the purpose of your life and your life meaning is to count on your senses, to count on who that you feel that you are, on who that you understand that you are, to listen to the inner voice that is building you, that is carving that path for you, for success for happiness, for security, for all kinds of confidence and good feelings of development and growth. So I bless you to have the ability to count on yourselves and to find true happiness always. Amen. Can you hear it soon? Please subscribe and like this video and share it with your friends to help spread faith in the world. For more, please visit amuna.com.